Yeah. Ethan developed a more severe form of Steven Johnson syndrome called toxic epidermal necrolysis, uh, T-E-N, so we call it TEN. Yeah. And he had a severe form of the eye disease as well. So you like wearing He was having a lot of pain and his eyes were completely red. Within two days, um, he was transferred here to Loyola. So in patients with severe um, inflammation of the surface of the eyes, we have been using some new surgical techniques to really prevent some of these scarring and blinding complications of Stevens Johnson syndrome. And there's actually a tissue called amniotic membrane, um, which is harvested from um, around the human placenta. We had two, I think two surgeries uh, within the first few weeks for his eyes where they did the amniotic graft. So what's done with the surgery um, is the membrane comes as a very, very thin sheet. It's actually uh, sutured or sewn um, just along the eyelash area. And then it's tucked underneath so it lines the inner lining of the uh, eyelids. There's a lot of things in there that really tend to rejuvenate the cells. Um, it promotes wound healing. And Dr. Lin and Dr. Bouchard both knew that the amniotic membrane graft was what he absolutely needed. We just published a paper in the journal Cornea which showed that patients who did not receive the amniotic membrane transplant surgery were about eight times more likely to have poor outcomes than patients who did have the amniotic membrane transplant surgery. We've been managing patients with this devastating disease for a long time and they require uh, a lot of support over time. When you talk to Ethan, you see what a zest for life uh, he still has. Ethan has come so far in the three years since his diagnosis. He has grown so much more than the average child. We've saved his vision. He can play like a normal kid. He can you know, go to school like a normal kid. Um, and it's just so gratifying for me to be able to be a part of that. Um, just as an eye doctor, I mean, to be able to, to save um, save the vision of a, of a small child is just, you know, it's really heartwarming.